Okay, this is a short video uh, about some of the uh, number five trails I bought. Uh, I'm here at my factory. I bought these during the week and I haven't had a chance to um, really have a look at them yet because I've been busy trying to stay ahead of the virus. Anyway, I've got it on my fork now with the slippers and uh, it's sitting there nicely actually. This is the one that I, uh, I'll call the number two because it's not as good as the other one and I towed this one on the back of my tray of my transit. Let's have a quick look at it. So, um, the bloke I bought it off, uh, he took these tyres off and wheels and stored it outside at his property at Yannicky. And uh, apart from thieves, uh, the weather got to it. So let's have a look. The wheels look all right. No rust, I'm happy with them. Um, I'm not too sure about the suspension here. Bit of rust there. They're still pretty solid, but um, maybe if I get them sandblasted or beaded, they'll come up fine. Uh, there's the axle. It's got a bit of rust on it, but um, I'm no expert, but I'm pretty I'm pretty happy with that. It's very solid. Now he's this um, set of springs is the same as the other side, so you can most probably see because I've got the sun in my eyes. It's a lot better. Yeah, a little bit of rust in this wheel. I'm going to take these wheels off and get them uh, sandblasted and coated, maybe even um, powder coated. We'll see, see how the funds go. Okay, look at the chassis. Um, yeah, a little bit of rust there, Not, nothing I'm really concerned about. Got a little um, sandblast off or sand off. I don't know if I'll get it sandblasted or not. It's pretty big. I've got a mobile sandblaster, but the uh, the media costs quite a lot of money, so it might be better off to take it somewhere and getting it done. That's most probably about the worst piece of rust on the bottom of this. Okay, then you go to the front, you can see the tack plates, and um, I'll take the fork down so you can have a look at that. But, uh, yeah, the body's taken a hiding because it was out in the weather. Same thing up here. Bit of rust there, the wiring's the shits, look at that. I mean, some farmer did that. Yeah, so I'll sort that out. I most probably, uh, my plans was when I bought this one because it was just offered to me after I bought the first one. Um, I'm, I'm just gonna use the chassis and maybe make a, um, a four wheel drive teardrop camper out of it. So, um, I've already got a camper pretty good for my truck, which is um, just over there. One with a skull on it. That's a Mitsubishi F G84. And it's got my camper on the back at the moment. Yes, yeah, so I was going to make um, a, a camper out of this for my mates so they don't have to sleep in the same room as me. But they couldn't anyway. Anyway, uh, getting back to the trailer. Yeah, the connectors are okay. Uh, this has got a bit of, fair bit of rust, so I'll most probably refab these. Um, I'll get a new jockey stand. That won't be hard. Uh, the hook's in pretty good condition. Okay, I'll go in the front of it, have a look. A bit of advertising for my company, Seatbelt King. Uh, yeah, everything's um, all correct on this. There's, no, there's nothing broken in the electrical, so um, it'd be good spares for the other one. Just let it down. Okay, so you can see a fair bit of rust here. Uh, it's still pretty solid though, so it must probably come up actually. I, th I thought that'd be almost like um, tin foil, but it's not. So a bit of rust here. Bit of rust here, but that's as solid as a brick. Bit of rust there. I'd say it's really had a spare tire or something. Now this is, yeah, that's pretty effed. I won't use uh, any nasty words because I'm going on YouTube. Same thing here. Um, it's actually, uh, it's had heavy stuff in it. I don't know why it's been carrying water or something. Rocks. It's a bit, it's a bit beaten up. Um, but when I picked it up, the, the chap I bought it off was, was um, 
cleaning it out with water and it was it's it was holding water so it's, it's, it's kept its integrity i just got to find another bung metal bung for us i might have to turn one up but um there it is i'm calling this one my number two so uh let me know what you think